Hello from Osaka. <laughs> we uh, got the bullet train here. Actually coming to you after the day when we were very hungover. I've had a lot to drink, I'm sorry. We're not hungover, you're hungover. Not a lot of filming went on. However, what did we get up to? Well, we checked into our Airbnb. This is the room. It's a bit wider than the last one, but again, very, very petite bed. Little tiny sofa. In the kitchen. This is the shower and the enormous bath. Welcome to your second. Oh, a bra. There's a bra. What isn't there? There is not a washing machine. That's two Airbnbs uh, now know. that have said that they've got washing machines and neither of them do. And we will run out of clothes now. <laughs> We're staying three minute walk away from the infamous Dawson Bury Street. It's where all the street vendors are selling food. We walked around that area, had a bit of discover. We went into the anime shop. Manga, oh, yeah. like Weird department stuff. store. Oh my God. 100,000 yen. 180, James. They are fascinated with boobs here. You so buy many boobs. Different sized dolls with different sized boobs. Yeah. Weird. All around that area, there's some really cool vintage shops, clothes shops. It also seems that they're really into their coffee in a huge way here. Yeah, way more than Tokyo, it seems. So this yeah. might be just the area. Um, but I mean, Osaka is known for its food and drinks, so. Still can't have them on the street, though. No. And there was one point we went for. What was it? Like a melon bread with ice cream dessert and it was so good and we realised five minutes later that we'd been eating it on the street and both of us were like, <gasps> oh my god! Um, and basically the premise behind that is it's just seen as quite rude. You're not going to get told off, no one's going to say anything to you, but it's Whoa, probably, rude. yeah, it's probably not going to help the stereotype of foreigners not knowing and respecting cultures. We then walked up to the Conrad Hotel. And they've got a lounge on the 40th floor. My latte cost £10. £10 for a latte! And then walk back down the infamous street, which looks really cool at night with all the lights. Yeah, loads of neon lights all the way down, old fashioned advertising signs. Yeah, uh, and then went to bed. So today we're going to do a bit more of the exploring. They do not have an English menu in here, but don't worry, Google is to the help. That's not the jam you're expecting. No. It looks okay though. It's great, I've just got that taste. <laughs> It's not a sacred yeah. castle, it's a professional Instagram photo shoot. I'm seeing oh my Instagram God. every second. Every bam. second. Bam, bam, bam. I think we're in one now. Well, they Pose. Do this, they do this thing where they bring the leaves or whatever they are, blossom to their mouth and smell yeah. it. Hypocrite. <laughs> it's like the ultimate game of hide and seek. This bloody castle is having a game with us. Get our beer on. It was nice in there. Um, however, nice. very expensive. 
we spent about £33 on and we had a pint and a half each. That is not a joke. However, we did get chatting to a local about things that were really interesting like rent, how expensive it is. So the, the flat that we're staying in, in Osaka, that would that would cost about £330 a month for one person. Which we were like, oh, it's not bad. Uh, but Good. in Tokyo, it'd be more than double yeah. that. Um, so it was really interesting and I'm really glad that we went to actually chat to someone. However, we better have a cheap bloody dinner. Because well, uh, that was cheap. pricey. Three colour plates is 129 yen. Right. It's about a pound. It's about 80p. Most expensive ones are these ones. Oh, fancy. 291 yen. 291, one pound 94. Oh, Jane's a really fancy drink of water. Someone smashed his knob off. So we're going for one last drink at a place called Backstage Osaka. Hostel and bar. Closed. We're back down the, th the, yeah. the popular through fair. Bar, shut. Bar, shut. It is Sunday bag shop evening. selling bags. It's open. past midnight now. I think we're going to struggle. We might have to go back home. It's only 2 a.m. I think we might be on to our winner. No, that's not that one. Oh, shit. We haven't got to press all at the same time. <laughs> Anything new you can see? Salad. No, we have salad at home, James. There's the green Fanta. That's weird. Yeah, that is weird. We literally couldn't find anywhere. Well, we could have. We could have tried harder. We're both so hungry. Whatever. So, need, need to see what this tastes like. I'm a big fan of being able to order breakfast items anytime. Oh, this is a teriyaki burger. You got a teriyaki burger? Very good? Mm. Nice, nice. This is why people come to Japan. We found a laundry and the great news is it's right opposite a cafe so we can sit and watch it, which we absolutely love. However, right. everything's in Japanese. I don't know how it works. One, add money. Two. But that says, I translated that before and it says no detergent. Detergent, do not put. But that doesn't make sense. <laughs> Twack it in. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in a game show. 31 minutes. Perfect. But it's open now. Can have a look in. Oh, so I think that's when, I think now is when you're supposed to add the detergent. And we're going to go for a coffee across the road. That konnichiwa is not hello. <laughs> it means good afternoon. So, Ohio means good morning, which it still technically is. True art. Just finished and... Uh. So I've just put my hundred in here. So I had to put it in first to release it. Now it'll add on. Oh, it will. Perfect. 16 minutes. Let's see how we go. We've just finished breakfast, lunch, brunch, whatever it was. That place didn't show up on Google and was really good. Really popular. Washes the dryers are here. Food is Perfect. there. Perfect. Also, we didn't get them, but PP Foss had them. Ricotta pancakes. Let me show you a photo because they look insane. So that's it for our Osaka trip. Two nights. It's been good, hasn't it? It's fun. What have been your overall thoughts? Well, it doesn't seem as busy as Tokyo. No. It seems a bit younger. Yeah, we've really enjoyed it, but I would say one or two nights would be more than enough to get a real taste for it. I think we're ready to go to Kyoto. Station. Let's do it.